the U.S. Securities and Exchange Commission will look into the appropriateness and completeness of J.P. Morgan Chase's financial reporting. Earlier this month, J.P. Morgan said it had lost at least $2 billion, a figure that's expected to grow on trades tied to credit derivatives. SEC Chairman Mary Shapiro said her agency's probe will focus on the accuracy of the company's first quarter financial and earnings statements. Shapiro said that the SEC didn't have direct oversight of the trades because they took place outside of the regulated brokerage. They are also designed for you. Finally, your invitation letter requested that I address recent trading losses reported by J.P. Morgan Chase. Our best information is that the trading activities in question took place in the bank in London and perhaps in other affiliates, but not in the broker-dealer that is directly supervised by the SEC. Although the Commission does not discuss investigations publicly, I can say that in circumstances of this nature, where the activity does not appear to have occurred in one of our regulated entities, the SEC would be primarily interested in and focused on the appropriateness and completeness of the entity's financial reporting and other public disclosures. Shapiro added that had the rules required by the 2010 Dodd-Frank financial oversight been in place, the SEC would have had a better idea of the trades that led to the losses at J.P. Morgan. Jessica Minton, IB Times TV.